Gods, Maria Sakari subscribed to Gladiator Stripe. I played with Donna Vekic and, and I think that that's it for today. Let's get it on. What's up, Gladys, and welcome back to Gladiator Stripe. And today's a little bit of a different format. I'm currently at the Dubai uh, WTA 1000 event in Dubai together with Nico over here. Oh, sorry, sorry, we're just cleaning my, my new shirt. <laughs> How are yeah. you guys? And uh, unlike last year, this year, I will try to upload a video every two days just to sort of keep you in the loop of what we're doing here and just so you Don't get... worry guys, I will force him to, to do it. Yeah, okay. it's it's all covered. And and yeah, there's, there's a lot happening already. It's day three, but yeah, for now, we're only gonna show you day one and two, so let's go. He's always on the limit. Gets late to, to, to go to the airport, he, on the limit what? of the wait. Only 30 minutes. Right? Only 50 minutes late he was. <laughs> sorry, sorry. Jesus Christ. <laughs> All right, boys and girls, our flight is departing in like an hour. We're at the business lounge right now. Nico, enjoy your meal, man. Sure, sure. So guys, we thought we were a little bit late to our plane because the boarding has started already and we were still at the lounge and uh, Turns out we weren't late. Basically, we are the economy, right? So we're taking, we're taking this route. There's the business class over there. And then up there, that's first class. This freaking plane, is this the? Gee, whoa. Okay, this is big. Nico hasn't seen a plane in his life. That's the <laughs> first time he's seen a plane. <laughs> that's what she <laughs> We look like brothers a little bit, which is weird. Guys, look at the name of our team. After destroying Nico at every single game available on the plane, they brought our meal, which was really not that bad. Guys landed, just landed in Dubai. A little bit tired, just just a little bit, but overall, the flight. But overall, the flight was fine. Yeah, got to figure out the the hotel situation now. Hopefully, the hotel is as good as last year. Nico, do you want any more bags? <laughs> Upon arriving on site of the tournament, we took a quick tour and got our accreditations as our room was still not ready for check-in. Mm. Nico. Yeah, baby. Is, is Nico hungry? Can you tell that he's a little hungry? <laughs> the moment of truth, we're gonna be entering the room that we'll be staying in for the next two weeks. <laughs> All right, you guys ready, Nico? Open the door. I mean, ah, I mean, right? I can live with that. Open it up for a okay. It's all right. It's all right. I'm all right with this. And so is Nico. Which bed do you want, huh? This one. I forgot to show you the bathroom, but look at this beauty. Kind of dark. We're gonna have amazing <laughs> bathroom. So, you guys might be wondering what, what the hell is going on. What, what's going on is that we got our accreditation. There it is. And actually this year it's not as cool as last year because last year I had one, two, three, four, five, six and the only one I was missing was, was seven. But this time we're missing the two and that's the, that's the VIP as you can see over here. And then we're also missing the eight which is the grandstand. So that's no good news but, but this year Kumba is actually playing the tournament, like the actual, she's going to be on the courts and uh, as a player of course she gets her awesome all access AA badge which allows you access, well, everywhere and she also can have two player guests and of course who else is it going to be, of course one of them is going to be me, hopefully we can also get that for Nico, well actually my badge is not 100% sure yet, I don't have it yet but hopefully we can get the all access badge for me and for Nico because this way I can show you around the entire tournament and, and, and show you everything. Because if you don't have access to the VIP and to the grandstand, what's the point, right? What's the point? 
But anyways, now I'm, uh, I, we just had a quick shower because, well, we're, we're nasty after the airport, like 12 hours of traveling or whatever the hell. And, uh, and now I'm playing at one with Kumba, so that's like in 40 minutes. And then right after, I'm going to hit a little bit with Nico just to feel and get the feeling of the ball and of these fast scores. Because tomorrow is when the intense stuff starts and when we're going to be having hittings all over the place. Because tomorrow, tomorrow, tomorrow all the qualifying girls are going to be requesting hittings. I think that's it. Yes. Let's all right, guys, down. guys, Nico is about to hit on the center court for the first time in his life. Really? At four with Haddad Mahi, I think so, yeah. Wow. It might it might actually be you, yeah. Either me or you. I said that they put you because because I wanted you to play on the center court. Thank you, man. Appreciate it. <laughs> Pro player. <laughs> oh my God, those abs. What abs? <laughs> no, <gasps> I can do better. Uh, okay, come on. That's one court. Oh my god! <laughs> so guys, now is uh, probably what's going to be the toughest hitting that I'm going to have overall, counting ATP as well. I'm going to be warming up with Kumba, so guys, this is going to be tough. <laughs> I look like an egg. <laughs> Say hi to go. Why is your camera so good? We got kicked out of court, uh, which court were we on? Court 7. We got kicked out of court 7 because Grisha, <laughs> because, because Grisha, Vince, no. Know. Wait, there's someone here, relax. Yeah, look, he's posing as he hits the ball. He's posing with his beautiful face. Yeah. <laughs> It's like Roger Federer, he doesn't even sweat. It's beautiful, man. Kumba. Wow, this has a nice zoom. Wow. Oh, wow, yeah, man. But these balls feel super light. What, what, what is it? Dunlop. Ayo. Yeah, baby, look how beautiful. What time is it? It's Time is it? It's Omega time. Okay. Lunch. Lounge. Lounge. Because you know, the players. Especially the tennis players. Cappuccino. Sinicova. Sinicova? Si. Ah, vale. Mwah. Doing some warm up over here? Yeah, of the wrist. Nice watch, Nico. Yeah, it's a Rolex, man. Just bought it. It's a Rolex? Yeah, 50k. Okay. I just met a fan uh, at the Dubai <laughs> Open here. You might know her a little bit. She's a subscriber now. <laughs> Maria Sakari, let's go. And Nico took. I have YouTube Premium, so. She has YouTube Premium. Yeah. You know that? I think I get a percentage of your YouTube Premium subscription if you watch my videos. Really? Is that true? I think so, yeah. <laughs> so then I'll just. Go watch <laughs> all of the videos. <laughs> Boys and girls, so. Three hours on court. I actually played more tennis today than I've slept. And Nico... Almost the same. I took a one hour same. nap, thank yeah. God. But uh, yeah, how are you liking it so far? I loved it. I trained with the 14 of the world. It was pretty good. I will show you a picture I took, but I look so ugly. So I'm not going to show you. And we're now just chilling, trying to relax a little. And probably going to go to the spa now, right? Probably not. We are going to the spa. Okay, glad. So, a question just just rose. Okay, I was trying to remember a word that I knew in Spanish, and I orca. was like, "Yeah, orca." Okay, orca. I, I was like, "What's what's the name of that thing?" And I was like, "It's like a black and white shark." He didn't use the word like. He said, "It's a shark, but it's white and black." Okay, and a orca. Okay, it's do you not do you guys? No, 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 stop. No, and he's like, do you "Why guys, you always want to be right?" No, okay, guys, I don't want to be right. Do you guys think that? A white and black shark is a decent explanation to try to explain the word orca or am I completely off and Nico is just he there was no way he could understand it's what a, I meant. It's a, it's a mammal no? Yes. It's a mammal it's a big mammal it's it's not a shark. It's a shark. Okay come. Guys comment below like it's actually serious stuff. Some hot water and that's cold water. That's cold water. Like super cold yeah. So, yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Let's yeah. go home, man. Let's go, man. Cheers, Cheers mate. mate. For... <laughs> All right, guys, we got some chicken fingers and some, some mozzarella sticks. Boom. All right, lads, this is round two. Hamburgers, some potato, some sweet potato. <laughs> Damn. I'm liking yeah. Dubai. It's so sad, it's not already. Que bueno, tío. This is an Audi R8, man. It's like my dream garage. What is actually going on? All right, boys and girls, what's the situation? So I'm playing with Bekic at 10, at 10. And I think it's a practice, not a warm up. So it's like at least an hour, maybe more. And uh, Nico, Nico is warming someone up at 10.30. So that's like half an hour. So I think we're gonna finish at about the same time. Hello, Glatz. So I'm heading to the club now, to the tennis club. Later, we will go to another kind of club later tonight. I wish. That's nice timing. Um, I have two warm-ups to do. I really don't know who I am warming up, but it's gonna be fine. Just uh, 30 minutes and 30 minutes, and we will be finished. And Grisha is warming up now. This Croatian woman, tennis player, obviously. So yeah, let's see how it goes. All right, glad. So yes, I met uh, Donna Vekic, played a little bit with her. Actually, we did like two or three practice sessions. It was quite interesting. Very, very solid player. Doesn't hit too hard, but she's super solid. So yeah, great tennis player. And she turned out to be a very nice human being as well. Very fun and... Uh, and interesting, you know, sometimes insert some spicy jokes and uh, during the practice, so that's that's always nice. Oh yeah, and by the way, it looks like I'm running around the court like a dog, but uh, that's not because I'm uh, I'm a defensive player, it's just because they told me to, to play defensive. They, the coach was like, don't, don't attack, so it's not that I'm like, you know, it's not like I can't beat her. <laughs> Donna, if you're watching this. <laughs> Alright guys, just finished the training, well not just, finished the training with uh, Donna. She wants to hit again in like uh, half an hour. But now, I'm headed somewhere, somewhere interesting. I'm gonna go get my accreditation. Boys and girls, so, how was your training with him? It was okay, it was solid. Okay, guys, uh, I'm playing with Bekic again in uh, five minutes. She <laughs> likes <laughs> Grish too much. <laughs> I should probably be going already. And uh, Nico. Nico is playing with. Who are you playing with at six? Uh, it's like in the top hammer. Yeah, she's, she's pretty good. It's alright. But also. And oh. yeah, they asked me whether I want to play or Nico. And obviously, I wanted to play with Badosa because I was like, Nico has been talking about Badosa since we arrived here. So I was like, oh. I'll, I'll break his heart if I say that I should play. So hopefully, we can get some footage of you practicing. Hopefully, here. man, hopefully. And yeah. So yeah, guys, this is the end of the video. I know it's it's nasty to be leaving you with uh, you know with that curiosity of of, of our practice with uh, with Badosa, but yeah, guys, stay tuned. It's gonna be a lot of fun in the next video. But that's why, why is it fucking? That's in the next video. Yeah. <laughs>